Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I just got back from New York a couple of days ago. I was there shooting with Cosmopolitan, which was so much fun. Um, if you guys missed that vlog, I will have it linked below, but I was literally there for two days. It was the shortest trip ever. Um, but nonetheless, it was so much fun. I just love going to New York. I used to live there. There's so many memories for me there and I just love the energy and the creativity. So yeah, it was really fun. And when we were done with the shoot, I did have some time to just walk around a little bit, uh, do some shopping. One of my favorite things that I got are two new crystals from the same crystal store that I went to back in January, which I showed you guys what I got from there in a previous haul. I also got some fun things from Sephora, uh, some skincare, and a few things from Whole Foods as well because I love Whole Foods, and um, something from Aloe Yoga, a new pair of shoes. It is also about 100 degrees today. I'm sweating. Like, I have little sweat beads forming on the top of my mouth because it's so, so hot. If I'm a little bit extra glowy, that is why. So I hope that you guys will enjoy this video and let's get started. So I'm gonna start with the stuff that I got from Sephora first. This is a toner that I have been wanting to try for ages. I've heard so many good things about this. It is from Ole Henriksen. It is the Balancing Force Oil Control Toner. And this says that it's a concentrated facial astringent that effectively absorbs excess oil and refines pores without stripping skin. And it's got a blend of salicylic, glycolic, lactic acids, and neem seed oil which helps to gently clarify, unclog, purify and minimize the appearance of pores. Instantly complexion is fresh and invigorated with a matte healthy looking Olay glow. You guys know I love a good glow but I do not like to be oily. I don't like to have like this t-zone part of my face looking too greasy or oily it makes my skin feel so fresh and clean but not dry like i don't feel like i have to rush to put a moisturizer on top after this it doesn't leave my skin feeling tight but i do feel like a nice fresh kind of invigorating tingling sensation on my skin and i think this would be a perfect toner to use now during the summer when it's super hot and our skin tends to get more clogged with oils and sweat so it's really important to to take all of that off at the end of the night and also just to start your day with really fresh skin before you do any makeup or if even if you're not wearing any makeup I think skincare is so so important you guys know how much I love skincare and this toner really does work and I'm super super happy that I finally got it another skincare product that I've had my eye on but is also not available here in Europe is the super goop skin soothing mineral sunscreen broad spectrum SPF 40. The whole super goop line is focused on sun care and SPF. That's like their thing. And what I really like is that they don't contain a lot of the harsher ingredients. So there are no parabens, synthetic fragrances, or oxybenzone in here. Plus it's a mineral sunscreen, which you guys probably know that I prefer over a chemical sunscreen because mineral sunscreens are just a lot better if you have sensitive skin or acne prone skin. A mineral sunscreen will sit on top of the skin and deflect the light, whereas a chemical sunscreen will absorb the sun's rays and then neutralize them in the skin. So it has to go through a chemical reaction, but mineral sunscreens will just automatically deflect the light from your skin and and they have been proven to work a little bit better than chemical sunscreens. But a huge problem with a lot of mineral sunscreens is that they leave a white cast and for someone like me who has more tense skin, I have to be super super careful with that because I don't want to have like a gray face and then you know a tan body. So I actually did lots of research a while ago on different SPFs and this was one of the best ones that kept on coming up but I couldn't buy it here in Europe and I just want to show you guys what it looks like so I just put a little bit on the back of my hand it just completely melts into your skin plus I really like the consistency and the finish of it so it is a little bit moisturizing but it's not greasy it's not heavy it's super super lightweight plus it sits really well under makeup as well it doesn't move around or pill up or feel too heavy I'm wearing it today and I've put like an extra amount on my forehead because I am going to go out a little bit later today I'm gonna go on my bike and be in the sun so I just wanted like a little bit of extra protection and I think my forehead looks great like it's not too shiny or too like heavy looking or anything at all so super super happy with super goop 
<laughs> this is not sponsored, I swear. Something else that I'm really excited about is from Tatcha. This is the Silk Canvas Filter Finish Protective Primer. And this has also gotten so many good reviews. Even the box that this product comes in is so beautiful. It's like this nice purpley blue. And then it comes in this like sealed um, package here. So I obviously have not um, tried this yet. That is so, so beautiful. Let's open it up. Oh. oh, it has a very clean, like powdery type of smell but not overpowering, like it's a very light and fresh scent. Mm. And I'm so excited to try this. Let me just try a little bit with you guys. Ooh, it's like butter. Oh my gosh, it's so, so soft. Let's put that on the back of my hand. That is so nice and smooth and silky, just like the packaging says. This is a primer that you apply underneath your makeup, and I wanted to get a more natural version of the Benefit Professional because I always apply that in uh, this part of my face. And this one is formulated without mineral oil, parabens, synthetic fragrances, sulfate detergents, phthalates, urea, DAA, or TEA. <laughs> it's non-comedogenic, non-irritating, non-sensitizing, and dermalogenic tested. It also says invisible layers of silk instantly filter away imperfections and impurities for alluring skin all day and over time. Blurs the look of pores, fine lines, and uneven skin tone. Primes with silk powder for long-lasting flawless makeup. Protects skin from makeup and pollution. Color corrects with a universal shade for a healthy soft focus glow. And it has anti-aging Japanese superfoods, which help restore the look of youthful radiance. So that sounds very good to me. <laughs> I will definitely use this the next time I do my makeup. Plus the packaging is so, so pretty. Very luxurious feeling and just very like sleek. So yes, very excited to try this. Moving on from there, I wanna show you guys what I got from Allo Yoga. And uh, for those of you guys who might not be familiar with Allo Yoga, they are a company that creates some of the most beautiful yoga outfits and just active wear clothing. They're super creative and kind of like out of the box with their yoga designs, but they still keep their designs very sleek and chic and feminine. And I just, I love their stuff. So they opened a store in New York City in Soho and the space is beautiful. I showed some clips of the store in my last vlog and on the second floor they also have a really beautiful space for yoga. It's very open and super pretty. Um, so yes, I wanted lots of different things in the store but I just got one thing that I really really loved and I think these are going to go with lots of different things. So I got these leggings right here. They are super beautiful and I love this uh, stripey detail and they fit so well they are super lightweight and they just hug your body in all the right places they're super comfortable and very flattering as well I just loved how these looked on me and I like that they're black because I can wear them with pretty much anything but I do really like the little detail the white stripey detail so it's a little bit different than a basic legging but it's not so different where it's difficult to like style it or wear it with different things so I'm super happy with these and I would highly recommend them. And then also speaking of yoga, I went to an infrared heated yoga class in New York and I always wanted to try an infrared sauna, but the fact that there was like a yoga class in kind of an infrared sauna was super cool. So I booked myself into that class and they offered these um, towels that you put on your yoga mat because you obviously get super sweaty. So I took a towel at the reception and I used it, but I was a little hesitant because I get very very sweaty and very like slippery in yoga classes even just a regular yoga class so I usually always wear uh, little socks and I will take my own towel just to kind of like wipe my hands off I know that might be kind of gross but it is what it is I get hot I get sweaty so I used a mat just like this and I was blown away at how good it actually worked like I ended up taking my socks off I felt totally free I didn't have to wipe off my hands and I was sweating you guys like this was no joke so I knew right 
right away that I wanted to buy one for myself. And it has these little silicone dots all on the back end of the mat so that the mat doesn't slip. And then this side is super, super absorbent. I don't know what type of technology this is, but whatever it is, it works. And for someone like me, as I mentioned, I get very hot and very like slippery in yoga classes. Um, this is like a godsend for me and I'm so, so happy that I found it. And first I was just thinking about getting like a normal one from any like workout store, but because I used this one and I saw that it actually works, I wanted to buy the exact same one. So I got this one from the yoga studio that um, I went to, which is called Yoga Vida. But I did some research online and these are actually produced by Men Duka and they're called the Yogi Toes. Uh, with skidless technology. The Manduka is available in a lot of different countries, so you don't have to go to Yoga Vida to buy this exact mat. You can find it on Amazon as well. They come in lots of different colors and different patterns. I got mine in this kind of like forest green, very like calming color. I really like this one. And then you just throw this in your machine and wash it like regular and you have a fresh towel to use. On the topic of exercising and working out, I also got a new pair of sneakers. These are my favorite running shoes ever. They are from Nike and I own this pair as well, which I actually bought back in I think like 2013 or something crazy like that, just before I left New York. So it was almost like five years ago now. And these are my ride or die favorite training shoes ever. I have tried other shoes in the past, but I always go back to these and that's when you know that you really love something is even if you have new stuff, you just keep going back to them. And the reason that I love these is because they are super, super lightweight and they almost feel like socks. They are very like um, thin and they just feel like you're not even really wearing anything, but they still provide support and they feel really good. And it was about time that I got myself a new pair of running shoes because those other ones are literally so old uh, and I think you're supposed to change your running shoes like every one to two years something like that just to make sure that the cushion and the protection on the bottom of the shoe is still working efficiently I really love these as well I think they're very cute and I like the simple black and white they are just as comfortable as the original pair and um, they're just the best running shoe ever and I also train in these I walk in these I travel with these they are super nice very comfortable and um, just lightweight and easy next i want to show you guys the two new crystals that i bought i went to this little place called namaste bookshop which i also showed in that video if you guys want to see what that looks like but they have a really nice selection of different types of crystals and i love crystals you guys they just make me happy and i love looking at them so these are the two crystals that i got uh, this first one here is an amethyst crystal it is so gorgeous look how beautifully that sparkles and it's all natural it amazes me so much that like this is the outside of the crystal and then you turn it around and you have this amazing art like nature's art on the inside it is just amazing and then this is the second crystal that i got this is a spirit quartz amethyst but because it has these kind of pointed ends and these formations that grow outwards it's supposedly a very strong crystal and has even more heightened healing powers and when i saw this you guys my heart like melted the way that it just sparkles and emits its light and creates light is just so so gorgeous and I could literally stare at this forever. I want to read more into crystals and their properties and how they work but for now I'm super in love with them as it is. I love having them around my home and just having them in a place where I walk past a lot or by my desk or in my bedroom where I can see them. Even if you don't necessarily believe in how the crystals work just by looking at them and seeing how beautifully they shine and the colors of them and the fact that they were just created naturally on earth i think that is super inspiring and a really nice way to decorate your home with a natural 
object. So I'm super happy that I got these. And if you guys are going to New York or if you live in New York, uh, definitely check out um, that store. It's called Namaste Bookshop. I also picked up a few things from Whole Foods, which is another one of my favorite places to go to when I'm in New York or just in the States in general. Um, they just have the best stuff. I love their prepared fruit section and their sushi and I'm getting hungry now. They also have some really great natural beauty products, which I love. Um, you guys know that this makeup remover is a ride or die. This is like holy grail status. This is the Earth Science Chamomile and Green Tea Eye Makeup Remover. It's a gel-based formula and it gets rid of every single trace of eye makeup, whether you're wearing eyeliner, regular mascara, waterproof mascara, this stuff takes it off and it's a very gentle and natural formula. I've been using this for the last, I would say, 10 years, could be more. I do try different ones, but I always go back to this one just because of how effective it is and how gentle it is around the eyes. This product is great and I of course had to stock up. I got three of these. And then this moisturizer also caught my attention. This is the Mountain Ocean Skin Trip coconut moisturizer. This smells so incredible. It does have a bit of a coconutty scent to it, but it's also very like suntan lotion mixed with a little bit of sweetness and it's beautiful. Like it smells delicious on the skin. I want to eat this. <laughs> it's got coconut oil in here, which is one of the main ingredients. But with that said, it's super, super lightweight and absorbent. This is especially perfect now for summer when it's really hot, but you want to maybe moisturize your skin and give yourself a nice glow. And it does not leave a heavy or sticky feeling. Like it literally absorbs in a few seconds and you're just left with really smooth skin that smells incredible. And um, it's really, nice to know also that the ingredients are on the better side of things. On the bottle it says the extremely fast absorbing and unique moisturizing properties of Skin Trip come from the ingredients coconut oil, aloe vera, and distilled lanolin. And apparently this is a moisturizer that's been around since the 70s. It is old school but it has like a cult following and lots of people love this. Um, totally new to me but I'm really happy that I discovered it and I've been using it every day since I got it and I love just getting little whiffs of myself when I'm walking around and I get like a little burst of wind I just smell this stuff and it is incredible and then the last two things I got from Whole Foods are these two teas this first one is called get clean and it's a herb tea for detoxifying and then this one which smells incredible this is called get relax and it's a herb tea for relieving stress Oh, that is so good. I love teas. I'm obsessed with teas. I love having green tea in the morning or in the afternoon, but at night I love a good herb tea, something that is naturally decaffeinated so that you can sleep well. And this has a blend of organic rooibos leaf, linden flowers, passion flower, eleuthero root, chamomile, English lavender, and damask rose petals. This one is super nice. I would highly recommend this one. And then I also got this one for like a little detox tea. This has also got organic rooibos leaf. It's got milk thistle seed, which is super good for your body. Indian sarasparilla root, dandelion root, chicory root, burdock root, and red clover. So I wanted to share those with you guys as well. I of course bought lots of other stuff at Whole Foods, which I ate, so I can't show you those. <laughs> those are all the things that I got when I was in New York, but I do have a few other things here that I ordered before I left and some little PR packages that have arrived, so I thought I could kind of include that in this video as well. And I have put some things aside for a little giveaway that I will be doing at the end of this video. First, I'll show you the things that I got from Cult Beauty, which is my favorite store for skincare products online. And they also do free shipping worldwide, which is insane. But anyway, I got a new uh, Sunday Riley Tidal Cream because I finished the other one up. This has been my go-to moisturizer for the past few weeks, and I just cannot get enough. I love it so much. It's super lightweight. It has like a gel-like consistency, so it's perfect now for summer when it's really hot and you just want something lightweight on your skin, 
but it's super super moisturizing and it actually has three types of hyaluronic acid in it and hyaluronic acid is something that really helps to moisturize your skin and keep it moisturized for a really long time so it is super super moisturizing but very lightweight um, and it just makes your skin glow and look super healthy and beautiful and nourished so highly highly recommend this and then this is so so nice this is from De Mamiel Botanics and this is a scented fragrance oil it looks like this this is from their sleep series so they have a few different ones they have one for like sleep like going to sleep and relaxing and this is their shine fragrance oil so this is something that you put on when you wake up it's very energizing and revitalizing it's very fresh and uplifting and feminine and invigorating it's a very uplifting scent and it just makes you want to get your day started like it's very energizing you can put this on your wrists like that you can put it here on your neck i'm so big on scents and aromatherapy i love good natural fragrances um especially for when i'm showering or i like to spray um something like this as well before i go to bed this is the restore aura spray and it's a spray that you can spray like on your pillow before you go to bed at night or if you're feeling stressed or if you're in an airplane and it's a little bit like claustrophobic it's a blend of completely natural fragrance oils that can really help to relieve stress or kind of center you calm you down or even if you just need a little refresher throughout the day something like this is super super nice so i love those and i'm also a huge fan of aromatherapy in the shower with um different like shower gels and stuff that i have i love a good scent and i think it can have such a nice uplifting effect on how you feel and then the last thing that i got is this beautiful book this is written by ray morris who is an incredible makeup artist this book is called makeup masterclass and it is such a gorgeous book i think i'm going to do another shot like showing you some of the pictures in here there's just so much inspiration in this book and it's an absolutely beautiful coffee table book or a book to keep in your makeup room or in your beauty room or even to give as a gift to somebody who is really into makeup or beauty i really love books like this and the photos are just amazing like look at how pretty that is so i will find a nice home for her so those are all the things that i wanted to share with you guys in this video i think i'm going to include the pr packages in an upcoming vlog because i don't want this video to be too too long but thank you guys so much for watching and i really hope that you enjoyed and maybe found some inspiration and i want to do another giveaway for you guys in this video so i've put together this little assortment of some really great skincare products and some makeup items all of these products are new you and if you want a chance to win all of these goodies all you have to do is leave a comment under this photo right here this photo is going to be over on my instagram i will also have a link for it down below in the description box you can leave me any comment that you like and that will count as your entry and then in about a week or so i'll contact you on instagram you can send me your address and i will send you your gift thank you guys so much again for watching i hope you're all having a really nice day and i will see you guys very soon with a new video Bye guys!